Hi, I'm Danny Parkins, and this is um, Lure Fishing with Danny. I'm going to talk you through setting up Texas rig for ras fishing. Um, what you're going to need are uh, a length of fluorocarbon, your cone lead, uh, a worm hook, and obviously whatever lure you're using, a Senko, X layer, um, choice up to you, really. So, we get you off from the start. So, what we do is so we get a length of fluorocarbon normally about two and a half foot three foot long and then you tie it to your braid um, I like to use a uni to uni because it's just an easy knot and it's I find it really reliable and nice and strong but you could use an Albright you could use whatever knot you're comfortable with so I basically do a seven turn uni with a braid one two three four five six seven pull that so it's nice and neat and this is the important bit when you're tying the uni on the fluorocarbon i like to wrap this three times just so it's nice and tight one two three and pull them nice and neat wet them with a bit of spit so it doesn't burn when you pull the knot tight Put it nice and tight so it's nice and neat and then snip off the tag ends leave a little bit hanging out there you go that's nice and neat now what we do now is we thread the cone head um, lead on which uh, I'm going to be using, I generally use sort of five, sevens and tens depending on the condition. So it's important you thread it on. So the cone head points forward, thread your fluorocarbon on, so it sits on the braid like that. Then you tie your hook on. You can put a bead in there as well if you want between two. I don't like to use a bead. I like to keep it nice and simple. So just the cone weight and then the hook. And this is a uh, Frio Gamakatsu, just round bend worm hook. And again, you could tie this on however you want it to. Uh, tight blood knot, uni knot, palomar, totally up to the person who's fishing's choice. So I'm going to use a little uni. One, two, three, four. A little bit of spit. Pull nice and tight. And again, cut the tag end off. Now we're fishing a shallow pool behind us, um, so I'm going to be using a quite a neutral coloured Senko. Uh, this is a, a wave tiki baby stick um, in four inches long. So you literally just thread that on, go up to like the start of the bend of the hook, bring it out, thread it around, turn it so it sits on, onto the off offset. And I like to fish one with the hook completely buried in the lure so I don't get snagged. So I just push the lure back, push it in so it's just nipping underneath the skin. Make sure it's nice and straight, it sits like that. And there you go, that's a rig. Ready to fish Texas for wrasse or whatever you want. Cheers.